Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy XIV. So have I been busy or what? I'm level 48 in botanist and level 47 in mining. I actually did the botanist one level higher. I was just busy watching something anyways. And so I kept going. One of the reasons why I kept going on the botanist and versus the miner is because today I noticed my log, uh, sorry, my um, timers here, that my allowance here shows a star on here. And I finally learned what this means. Basically, you get a bonus on this, I guess, EXP or something like that on there. So I went ahead and farmed that. I also used the resource, the FF14 uh, console games wiki. So basically, I just typed in honestly um minor quests and botanist quests uh wiki and their page came up and they have a list of just what the items you require so i literally just went around using that information and just mining i just enjoyed mining and doing the botanist stuff over and over and over and i did that for literally hours just it's one of those days i didn't really feel like recording at the time and just wanted to relax and uh, so that's what i did so we're going to go ahead and start with, and yeah, this is going to be another botanist and mining uh, episode. Uh, it wasn't planned, but it was just one of those days where I wanted a bit of a break and just relax, and uh, well, now we have all this progression, I want to show it off, right? So we're going to go ahead and hand this in over here. Uh, I've done this, what, a couple times now, and uh, this is a good way to get your seals, and uh, good way to level up too, so undertake supply and provision missions. So you're going to want to be in your right one. We're in the, that one right now. So we'll go to these guys. And so see, they, the, the star makes it more EXP. So see how that's only 232k and that's 572k. That's kind of why I went ahead the extra mile and just did that. Now when you hand these in, you want to give the um, HQ version because, well, you get double that. So we're going to go ahead and say OK. And look at that. So we get this and then you get your HQ bonus, which is literally just double everything, which that's pretty badass and definitely worth it in my books. That almost got us to uh, 49 just there, which is great. Now let's go ahead and switch. I don't know what happens if you don't switch and I'm not taking that chance, of course. So uh, one day maybe for fun, but uh, I don't feel like doing that today. Okay, so same idea. We'll go ahead and we'll and take the HQ. So this was raw zircon. Zircon, Zircon, and do you want to trade the high quality items? Yes, I do. And there you go. Look at the amount you're going to get there and the amount that you're going to get there. So this is going to get us to, look at that, it got us over. So though, even though I had a whole level on the other one, it still was quite a lot there, uh, which was kind of the reasoning for that. And hopefully that makes sense why I did that. So there you go. That will reset tomorrow sometime for me. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, do some of the stuff here. Let's, I guess we should do mining, because mining looks like it's going to be done anyways pretty darn soon here. So let's go here. So I already have up to the level 49 of the mining stuff and the herb stuff done. So we did to what? Four? No, we did to 35 or 30? Or f did we go higher? I don't remember, honestly. I know we, we did pretty good, but I actually don't really quite remember. So let's go to Miner's Guild. Either way, it's going to be a big woohoo for us, I think, this episode. That's kind of my plan anyways. So we're going to go... I always get lost on this one for some reason. There we go. I think this is the right... Oh, no, we, we actually got lost even more. So we're, we're definitely set on Miner. Now, hopefully these quests aren't like, can you please go 100 miles away, talk to this NPC and back? If it's so, whatever. We already got the other part done, but um, yeah, so some of these probably aren't going to be an upgrade for us. I cheated, not really. Literally, I just went to a vendor. I'm going to show you where I went, and I got these pretty darn cheap. Uh, I didn't pay for them. I just I got them really cheap on the thing, right? So uh, if I do item comparison, these are probably going to be, yeah, look at that. This is exactly the same as I already have, so I probably bought these... Did I buy from an NPC? I think I bought them from an IP NPC. I might have even bought them from the market. No, I think it was NPC. But we already have uh, basically all these, apparently. Yeah, we, we have all the exact ones, basically. So, yeah, these are all useless. So I guess that means the next stuff will be better. I don't know why I sat there for so long.
Okay. Hey, pain in the ass. So wait, would I own them here? Having them already in my pocket? Okay. And then there you go. We have 74. Oh, uh, yeah. I kind of got way more than ever anyone needed. Huh. <laughs> okay, there you go. So we'll just go and get the uh, the gold there. Might as well. And that's not going to probably be an upgrade because I, I did get a slightly better one on that, I think. There you go. And look at that. We almost dinged from the rest of that one. There you go. Was that from another player or something? I guess so. Uh, okay, so let's just... I'm not going to go look at them. We'll get them when we do it. Okay. See this place? I want to show you this where I went, but yeah. Okay. Hey, buddy. We're up for a contest. Huh. <laughs> Where did he go? <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so, um, let's do a comparison on that thing. So I already have the same one on that because I, I did play around with I don't know if I if it was all just from vendors or not. Um, so that's a nice one. Basically, your main stats come from your the weapon and the offhand, I think. But still, I mean, if you can get some good stuff off of here, why not, right? So uh, let's look at these pants. So that's a mask. Guess it doesn't really matter, but there's gathering on there. So you want to do you know like look at that. So. There is literally only two gathering difference, so that's it's not as exciting, right? That, on the other hand, has six more on those, so that's that's kind of nice. I'm learning that those are kind of an important thing. Uh, this has three gatherings, so that's not too bad. And this has two on that, so uh, I definitely go for the the mask. And there you go, my friends. You ready? There we go. Boom. And we're level 50 on that. And there you go. Uh, we have some notes to look at, and I actually want to look at them together here. 
Um, because I got some when I was leveling anyways, but here we go. Legendary nodes and tomes of regional f uh, folklore. And I've heard about these. I don't know much about them, but basically they're special books I guess you can get and stuff. Among unspoiled gathering points, and those are something I want to explain. And Well, we're going to read and ex see what we can come up with it. There are legendary sites that can be discovered by acquiring tomes of the regional folklore. Each volume contains a tales of traditions of a particular region and use that item to add information information to your gathering log special volumes you have yet to obtain can be reviewed in your gathering log there are so many valuable resources out there waiting to be found and begin by collecting tomes of the regional folk uh lore which that sounds pretty cool honestly i don't know much about that so i guess it continues leveling i actually did not know i would level past 50 i thought because isn't it 50 is the cap or whatever the normal like uh you know aar and i thought even if i owned the expansion i thought or i guess i assumed your leveling would stop but i guess maybe that's not the case actually um but anyways let's go to um act of help and we're gonna check out one a uh, couple here that i got recently and let's see if i could search through it one was called unspoil Okay, unspoiled location. So this is something I got. It just popped up, right? And yeah, so it's the uh, disciple of the land actions, truth of the forest and truth of the mountains. Enable you to detect. So it's just this icon here. Uh, and my other gatherer has uh, the, I guess, truth of the forest. Enables you to detect unspoiled gathering locations and display their location on the minimap. So I can run this anytime. And that's it. You were unable to locate mining points. So it stays on. So I'm guessing when you run around, when you're doing your gathering stuff, it will over time show something up on the map, I guess, a special node. Uh, the special sites cannot be found with Lay of the Land or Arbor Call. So I guess this is Lay of the Land. Yeah. Uh, and then the Botanist is the other one. Nor are they always uh, present in the field. Furthermore, they may take hours or days to return once spent. So one thing from my understanding, there's lots of resources and websites with timers and info on this where you can go ahead and do this if you like, even for your phone, for you guys who are on like maybe on a PS4 and stuff like that. I'll look into those over time, but not gonna not gonna push too much on that. I'm learning so much already. I need time to absorb, right? And sometimes I don't mind messing up and stuff. Upon successfully gathering an item from one of these locations, the times at which it can be gathered will appear in your gathering log. Proceed with caution. However, these points are known to dissipate upon abandoning gathering. So I guess if you close the window, you know, for gathering or something, because you want to change something or do something, I guess maybe it dissipates I'm, I'm assuming it's like a one time if you don't go in properly and you screw up kind of thing that's your own fault maybe okay so that was that one and we also got one that was interested which was called uh time worn maps and i actually have one in my inventory that's actually how it just showed up when i was doing my stuff oh, i forgot that happened sorry guys uh time worn there you go and in the course of gathering uh so your disciples of the land will occasionally discover items known as time uh worn maps fishers can only obtain the maps when using uh the snagging action these tombs can be examined by using the general uh, uh action decipher so i don't think i've actually seen that so it can be examined by using the general so that's the regular thing called the cipher so we'll look into that if you wish to learn more about time worn maps it's recommended you visit the wine port in eastern blah 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 so i'm more interested in this ability that i don't think i have or is that something i don't remember having so character actions traits it said general but i don't think they oh yeah they have a general trait okay so i don't see that one item that they suggested do you guys no it was a pretty pretty uh, obvious icon too it was like a kind of a torn up tattered map so i don't see it there uh let's check the botanist here so you got your botanist you got your traits here oh okay i didn't realize you got those kind of traits over time that's really cool actually so at level 50 uh the 12 bounty now extends to clusters huh 
Occasionally increase the yield of items with HQ version conditions increased, blah, blah, blah. That's cool. Now extends the crystals. But I don't see the... I'm going to look that up for a second then, just because I'm interested. I mean, I think you guys are interested too, so let's see if we can figure that one out. Okay, so apparently you can actually do this uh, and unlock this. I just looked it up and there's a way to do it, so I'll have to play around with that. What are you offering anyways? Oh, look at that. Another pickaxe. Um... Now, and I know they have one after this, too. Those are not so, such bad items, too, to be honest. Um, and you get a lot of EXP, which I guess at this point is not bad. So that's the level 45. Wait, did I do the 45 one? Oh, my goodness. Okay, I didn't realize this, but that's level 45, man. So I've done three different ones on top of that. Camp Brown's Lake, yeah. Which we've already done. There you go, buddy. Yeah, okay, so that was the last one I did. So that was the level 45 stuff. I didn't realize, so we were, yeah. I, I literally thought I did the 45 there one, so that's pretty good. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna get that anyways, and here's the here's the problem. What did I pick that I was like, oh, that's good enough, and then I'm not gonna touch that. We're gonna reject it actually. I assume you can do that, right? There's no punishment for rejection. Uh, it's like you have been okay. So we did get a new hat, but how 44? Okay. Wasn't sure how good it was. Okay, so we'll do that again. There we go. Okay. Yeah, you can do that. Okay. So you could upgrade the hat again, which I don't think is worth it. Uh, this might be interesting. That's eh, not too bad. Wow. Uh, 47 to something. Yeah, I like that. Because you still can get the other ones from other ones, right? Like, I'm thinking, you know. I think I'll get that one then. And there you go. And then, of course, let's upgrade ourselves here. There you go. And, yeah. So now we're, we're really awesome with those attributes. We're starting to get up there. Okay, so let's go over here. And, oh, yeah. this is So this is the final, like... Uh, I guess this is the final uh, one for uh, this, so let's let's grab it anyways. Cannon of Regret. Okay. Now I, I don't have these items, by the way. I'm not that amazing. Okay, so we can go and hear this guy's story. I'm thinking this might be a little bit of a longer episode again, but we'll see. Let's go talk to her again. I drunk. Huh. 
Dark steel. Oh, you need to find the truth of the mountains technique to locate unspoiled material deposit. At one AM. <laughs> okay. Okay, let me take a picture of this because I can probably figure this out on the internet too after. Okay. Now, if you want to, you could probably do this another way. Like, okay, go ahead and deliver this. Actually, why can't you deliver this? Why is it red though? Interesting. So you could probably buy this. I don't know what it's valued at, but I'm almost tempted to see. But uh, let's go to the the next place. Let's do our uh, botanist and uh, go from there. But very interesting. Also interesting on that you can still level up further. That was a very interesting one for me. I did not expect that at all. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're going to go to botanist guild. Hopefully there's no botters at the botanist guild. I know, I'm silly. Okay, so, uh, first of all, let's get you some recommended gear, because you can have some of the new gear there. So even that alone should help, you know, bring some of these up a bit. Yeah, there you go. Nice. Okay. And then same thing again here. We're going to be doing, I guess, three solid quests here, which probably is going to bring us to... Uh, it should do it, so... Okay, I'll get that for you. Oh, look it, I got it for you. <laughs> there you go. pain in my butt. You go deliver it. I have to actually go deliver it. <laughs> there you go. What is this, like Mother 2.0? Okay. We'll go hand that in and do the other two. Mostly because I wanted the cool upgraded upgrades we saw. Okay. Forgiven-ish. It's like I don't mean to burden you. It's like you've burdened me though. Don't know if I can forgive you now. There you go. Ding de ding. There you 
go. Let's do the next one here. <laughs> is, she, is she Canadian, I wonder? Zucchini. Zucchini. I got your zucchini. There you go. These ones are, you know, kind of dirty sounding. Ramhorn zucchini. Oh my. And of course, if I log off with that zucchini and come back 10 years later, it's going to be just as fresh and handing it in like this. She'll be like, oh, it's so fresh. I might be being slightly silly there. But you get my point. <laughs> Here's your zucchini again. names. No, I don't have an idea. Oh my. <laughs> it's like you do the work and then you're giving other people the food. Okay, so, um, yeah, we have an upgrade for the pants, and I don't know which one was going to be better, because we got pants for the, see, I didn't really pay attention to that, so this is Crisis of Faith, right? Let's look on here, so there's the pants, and you get, oh, there was boots for the next one, so, and you get other stuff later on, I don't think it's going to matter too much, to be honest, but, uh, anyways. I think we already decided one of them, right? Like we said this one or something, or... Uh, that, we do use that quite a bit, though. I'll go with you. There you go. So, level 50. There you go. We're going crazy, my friends. And then we can go ahead and uh, do our upgrade here. Nice. And let's grab the last one here. So there you go again. And I'm going to show you that place today. Okay, we got to do a bit of running around, unfortunately, on this one. Um, yes, I know where we're going. I just wanted to see what the thing was. What's the closest on that? Oh, wait, what the... Is that really the best one right there? Ah, screw it all. That's when it's like money is not as, uh, you know, not as much of it. Oh, well, I have very little money right now, but I'll show you later why it's not such a big deal to me right now. Oh, yeah, we don't have that. Doop, 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 doop. The knot. So I guess we go ahead and yeah, you go back up and do that. I was like, huh, you don't want them? It's always the case. Okay. 
Okay. I like the... I'm gonna miss this one. This one is kind of cool because the feathers on the axe. Kind of rainbow-ish. It's beautiful. Okay. It's like freaky when it changes the inventory. It's like, ah, I failed you. <laughs> I would like to be alone. Well, you could be alone with your thoughts. Just give me my damn reward. Uh, item comparison. So that's kind of a nice one. I'll probably go with that one or let's see how much of a jump this one is. Uh, I'll go with this one. Never did check this one though, did I? Yeah, I'll go with uh, the, this one then. Just double checking, yeah. There you go. And then of course what we're gonna do now is we're gonna talk to her about the new ones. So this is the kind of stuff you can get later on, right? They say botanist even though you can, I, I, oh, what? Oh, you gotta be kidding me, they're jerks. It says BTN on them. No way, they are jerks. Yeah, because these are all classes. These are actual class specific items. What jerks? Oh well, that's fine. I mean the 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 the, the you know tool is awesome enough, so that's fine. So this will be something similar to the other one, I'm assuming. Everyone wants to resign, apparently. Oh, okay, that works for us. We're actually going out to uh, that area, which is, this is a good thing. So we're gonna go here. This is the central one. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the Black Shroud and we're gonna go into um, Central Shroud and we're gonna go to Bent Branch here and we'll go from there. These people are so dramatic. Here, I thought the buffs were, you know, like how I was getting like some of the buffs automatically carried over and stuff. And I guess I didn't realize that you're getting them. Hmm. Anyways, I don't know what I was trying to say now. My brain's like, Whoa. okay, so let's go ahead. Put our new tools to good use here. I love that. Okay, so we're here. And we're going to go from here. And uh, we're going to walk all the way up to. Uh, oops, sorry, not that one. Wait, did we screw up? I screwed up, my friends. I apologize. I don't know how I screwed up, but uh, I screwed up. Let's go to... So the best way to see this is go this way and then look on the map where you want to go. So we want to go to Fall uh, Gord... Fall Gord uh, Float, I guess it's called. Sorry about that. So we're going to North Shroud. I'm not sure how I missed those two, but... Especially since they're quite different, but anyways. And yeah, so same idea. Uh, and I think we've been in this area, but I don't rem It's been so long. It's a very beautiful area. I think we've probably taken shortcuts through here or something from time to time, so. But uh, I don't think we've ever gone like where we're going now, so. This is actually perfect timing. Well, I would have liked to do this slightly early, but. 
Because, uh, like, daytime, right, for you guys to see it a bit more, but whatever. We'll get to see some light here. Now, we probably should turn our sneak on. Sometimes you forget those, and it's not a good idea. Because sneak will give us, well, we can pass anything, basically. 54, basically, is it would be the level right now, right? So, yeah, pretty much everything, you know, in A Realm Reborn you're okay with now. Okay. So we're going to work our way over here. So this is this is this zone. Very cool looking zone. Very snowy. I think that's pretty badass. So I we're going to meet somebody up here. There's a fort over here. Uh, there's something over there, but we'll look into that in the future. We're going to focus on our uh, two uh, level 50 quests here. Look at that place, this is pretty cool looking. Can't wait to do some of the stuff in this area. Like, I know we're focused on more of the story quests, so we don't really do stuff out here as much, but even then, like later on, you know, we're gonna come back with other classes and level them up and things like that, right? And I think that's gonna be a lot of fun, checking out some of these and doing just like the random quests around. I'd like to be as completionist as possible one day. That's honestly a goal I'd have in mind. The music is sweet. Okay. There you go. 9 a.m. So we got a task for 1 a.m. and 9 a.m. I got a picture for both. And there you go. I have them on my thing. So, um, 1 a.m. is going to be a while yet. So I'm just going to show you. So when I first came in here, I think I was doing some stuff around this area. And the second time was around here for the stuff I needed for the herb and mining. I think most of it was just mining, but herb had one in this area. But just to give you a rough idea what I was doing here. Um, I do apologize I didn't show you that like I said I was just relaxing you know and I do have a habit of at least coming back and showing you exactly what I was doing so I didn't even touch this crystal I don't have a way to get here or anything I wanted to show you getting here properly us together so you can see I, I kind of like was like going like this when I was doing it off camera because it's like I didn't want to get spoiled everything's just so cool looking didn't even chat this guy here There you go. Okay. Cool. There we have it, my friends. So a whole new area, new land. There's a place called Foundation here. Oh, that's cool. It looks like a city. What the hell? An actual city in the mountain or something. At least that's what it looks like on the map, but... Okay, so give me a few minutes and I'm going to do a little research on this. Basically, this is the button, so let's let's make sure we got all the right skill on this. We do, okay. And then we saved it, yeah. So we should go miner now. Same thing, let's get our change gears here. There we go. And we'll go ahead and update the gear as well. And there you go. So we're, we're set there. And then and it was just this button right here. And apparently, unable to locate blah, blah, blah. And apparently, you can do this only at uh, 1 a.m., right? So I'm going to look on the internet, do some research, wait till it gets closer to there. And then we'll see what we can do with it. Okay, so there's something that popped up, but I don't think it's like, yeah, rocky something up here. It's not related to the one what we're going to do. It's just one that's here. And so I'm going to check it out. Yeah, here it is. I don't know what's in this one, actually, because of the location. Um, I looked up some guides. They re recommend using the unspoil. I might even screw this up and it might disappear on us, which is whatever. But uh, where is my character? Actions and traits. So you want to use the one called unspoiled, I believe. No.
I don't know which one it is, to be honest. I don't see it here, unfortunately. Increase the chance of obtaining blah, blah, blah. Does not increase, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, I don't. Clear vision increase, blah, blah, blah. Next gathering. Preparation reveal the conditions of the object. Yeah, I don't see it actually here. So the idea is there's an ability that people recommend and it's supposed to reveal what's in there you can do and I mean like as a newbie that might be great for something I don't have a clue but I don't actually see it on here and that's the weirdest part of it give me a sec <laughs> I screwed up and I shouldn't have done that it's not even in there I don't understand they say it should be in there and it's not there toiler of the mountaineer I believe it's called and uh, it wasn't there. It's like this kind of, but the opposite. And, uh, yeah, I didn't find it at all. And I don't see it in the future. It's supposed to be a level 50 skill, so it should be right, you know, between here to here, I guess. This is used for, um, I guess, special quests and stuff where you have to gather the item. And they use this so... That basically, uh, the way it works is that you can't just buy it from another player. Uh, this puts like a, a bind on you and it puts a special tag, I guess, and it's only for special items. But, interesting. But yeah, I don't see it on here, so we'll just, uh, you know, whatever kind of thing. But uh, anyways, we will wait and uh, do it on the actual thing and hope for the best here. Because it's, oh, it's going to happen actually very soon here. I know it's on level three slot, so um, and it happens anytime now. So that's actually good. One minute, and I'll get. An, uh, there's an alert. I have this app that uh, not an app. It's called uh, GarlandTools.org/slash/bell. Um, I don't know if they have other tools. I just I googled it and found that one. But uh, yeah, so where we're going is probably going to be roughly in this area. So. It should just appear just the same as what we saw. And uh, if you Google what, if you know what you're finding, which is probably how you're usually doing it, you're not going to just randomly do it like what I was doing there. But if you know what you're looking for, more than likely you'll just uh, Google the slot. So I literally Googled it, right? And they said it was slot three. So that, that makes kind of sense. And they tell you even on this site what they are. They say... Uh, there's a worm on slot one. There's a dark steel ore on slot three. And then the spruce log that I need uh, for the next one is in slot six. So so it says 10 seconds from now. So in 10 seconds, theoretically, probably right here, because look at all the people here. This should be the dark steel. Look at all the people here. So there it is. There you go. So, oh, it, it's already showing. Maybe it's changed from back in the day. So, right off the bat, you want to increase your chance of obtaining items by 50%. Uh, I probably won't. Yeah, why not? I think that does it all, right? So, that's going to use most of it. And then 10% increase the chance. Yeah, we'll do that. So, we'll do... There you go. And then we'll do this one for HQ. If I have enough. Oh, I didn't have enough, did I? Oh, no, I did. Okay, there you go. There you go. And there you have it, my friends. Maybe we'll get lucky and get HQ one. That would be awesome, but not this time. One last time, my friends. There you go. Okay. That's... That was literally all it is, my friends. <laughs> and uh, that's what they were all doing there. They probably got HQ versions of it and stuff. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, yeah, we got 18 of them. 
And I don't know what their value is. They probably go for a bit of uh, value on the market, but hmm, either way, pretty cool. So we'll wait for the next one. The next one for me is in 21 minutes, so I got time to kill. But uh, either way, at least now we know about that, and we'll see how that goes, and we'll go from there. Okay. I wanted to go ahead and hand this in instead. I thought, hey, it'll give us uh, better gear, right? Or no, actually, it's all... Yeah, no, that, never mind. I forgot about that. It's class base. I was like, hey, I'll use the gear and help my other guy, but whatever. Uh... <laughs> but there you go. There you go. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> I guess it's like a really special ore. <laughs> yeah I didn't realize it would be this long it's gonna be our longest episode yet I think could have easily broken them up but whatever mind returning back got a little surprise for you those items I wanted ah oh. No, she wants to tell me stuff instead. <laughs> there you go. So this is your options. 
Um, so I guess we should just, because it doesn't matter what we pick, we want the best option, right? Especially since, uh, yeah. So, 44, 12, yeah, so you got 12 on there. Sorry, I'm just making sure of time. Yeah, we have lots of time. 12. Wow. Oh. I didn't realize that has a time bit. You have, yeah, but that's that's pretty nice there. What about this one? 34 to 42. And then 21 to, yeah, and then you get a bit more gathering on that. It's it's a hard one to decide, honestly. I would say the helmet's probably going to be the best one because it really has to do with that perception on it. This one, on the other hand, is not too bad either because it gives three extra. But I feel like our biggest concern and issue is actually bringing this up as high as possible. More rarity, better chance, yeah. Plus, this will boost up our gathering a bit, so we'll get higher chances, yeah. We'll go with that. <laughs> there we go, my friends. So, like, just to give you an idea now, I mean, we were paused for a couple minutes, but now the, uh, the dark thing's over. There you go. So we're level 51. But that's it. We we've learned our training. That that that's over. We we are done. Basically, the miners' guild for a realm reborn. That's all she. You know. That's it. Which is pretty cool. Uh, so let's go ahead and put our new items on. I like to look at the stats. So 218, 214, and uh, here we go. 253, 246. That's awesome. And then I'm kind of curious a bit on. Um, Let's use this. I'm gonna go back. I'm just curious to check out uh, the market thing here. I don't know if we'll find anything our level, but I wanted to show you what I was talking about anyways, where you can buy some stuff as well. So of course you got the market over here. Um, but if you go over here, it's the battle one for this one, which is weird. I don't know why, but you go to the Battlecraft person here, you can do Disciple of the left and right gear. And then there you go, you can get to the 49 to 40 to 49 gear. So you might find some upgrades here, but like this one is probably an upgrade. Um, so if you check it out, you can actually see that it's, it's a slight, slight, slight upgrade, which is not bad. Uh, for the tools, on the other hand, though, you go and get them over here. There you go. I mean, there might be another spot, I don't know, but I, I just lo noticed this is a land, right? And then you can go here and get your tools from here. So, um, this is this is the tools. It's plain and simple, right? So, these are the hatchets. I don't I don't think they're the off. Oh, no, there's the sledgehammer. So, they seem to come with one off hand for each one. So, there's the, well, the sledgehammer, which I guess we have that or better, right? What? Actually, apparently we don't have a good one like that. Interesting. So this would be a better one to get, which might not be a bad idea. Now, I'm just curious, just because we are 50 or 51 technically now, uh, what, what's on the board? Let's just see what's going on here. Um, so let's start with... Uh, da, 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 da. Sorry, it's hard to tell from this stuff here. Minor tools. There you go. So, look at this one. Oh, I bet you I can't get that one. Holy, yep. So, this guy's, these are pretty expensive. Other people have made them from time to time, but uh, a little out of our league. There's a, even another one that, I guess, I guess the item level, oh yeah, item level 70. So, it's huge. There's this one, which brings down the price, but still quite expensive in my opinion. And then it just goes down from there, probably quite badly. Um... You can't even, there's none on that one too, but, uh, yeah, so, yeah, you can use this, but you're gonna probably not find anything amazing. Um, I don't know why that one's expensive, maybe it's that expensive, maybe it's just more like that's just how it is, right? 
Uh, same with the botanist stuff. If we look up the botanist stuff, I'm pretty sure it's going to be just as expensive. These ones are actually slightly cheaper than the other ones. Uh, but you can see the, the more expensive ones here. So look at the difference from that 82 to 72, 126 to 143. And that's a big deal too, honestly. But uh, I'll leave it for now. I'll decide in the future. And then you can go with your armor, like body chest plate here. Um, so you can get gather on this one right here, which is probably decent compared to what I have. But there's none on there. Holy crap. So, I mean, these might not be that expensive, but they seem very expensive to me, so. It's funny, this one. Oh, because it's level 50, so I see. Well, that's craftsmanship anyways. So, oh, I see. This one is, huh. Because it's the new expansion content, I guess. So it goes from 60 to 60, huh. So there you go. And you can see the uh, jump there, too, especially for the high quality. Yeah, I can look through all this. I mean, it's probably going to be the, the same story. I mean, there's going to be lots of these guys. There might be some that are worth it. Uh, so this is gathering. Uh, gathering is what we want, not worth it. Seems like the gathering ones get kind of shafted the most, I will admit. Uh, so here's this one. Oh, there's none even in there. So um, perception on this one. Here you go. Yeah, so... I think in the end, where you're going to find somewhat of, uh, like, a good filler, just, you know, just, just a filler, right, would be this one right here. And uh, you could probably just get a few items done. Now, here's the problem. Can I? Oh, no, I can't open this. Okay. I was worried I couldn't open this. So we were looking at uh, the sledgehammer. So 4477, and then this one was 41. 72 so right off the hand bat that's good now i highly doubt it's going to be better than this thing this is a pretty nice tool 112 um yeah you're not going to get better than that you know outside of you know something else right but uh yeah and then uh it's probably gonna end up being the same with this but i'll i'll do that off camera or whatever let's go back to the other guy over here since we're here oh yeah let me check something here Okay, nothing here worth repairing still by the way um actually surprised how much your durability gets used just from just just mining and stuff i already did this earlier today and they were almost all broken to give you an idea like that crazy oh yeah we should probably did we get oh yeah we got the upgrade there so of course we like to see our upgrade change the stuff there Whee! and then we'll do update update gear so there you go so my item level is only 33 for my gear <laughs> what was the uh, item level of this one 55 55 so you probably want to aim for around 50 eventually okay so this is the one right yeah okay so we're gonna do 40 to 49 we'll do the same thing that I know especially I can open this up and uh, this one's confusing because it's backwards. And then, yes, yeah, so you go to the last one on it. So the helmet, no matter what, we're not going to replace that because it's probably the helmet for both of them is where the sweet spot is. So I'm going to probably keep it as the same. So this one here, uh, the, the chest piece, 48 and 24, 48 and 24, 48 and 24. Just a slight upgrade, uh, which is kind of meh. Uh, but at the same time, might still be better than what we have. I guess the gloves will be the same thing, right? So you gotta get make sure you get the right ones. 34 gather. This one is 34 gather, so you're not gonna even get better on there. The belt, on the other hand, that's probably not been touched for a while. Uh, Raptor belt 12, 10. So a slight slight change there. Um, I guess every little bit helps though. And then let's look at the boots. Are these boots or pants? Leggings. Okay, so leggings 19 gather. And, oh, look at this. That's 24. So, yeah, that's definitely an upgrade. And then the boots themselves are 21. And that's 24. That's pretty good. Now, if I wanted to, I could min-max and get maybe that chest piece, which, you know, is not a bad idea, but I don't really have that money. Well, I kind of do. 
And I think that's time for us to start using it. I was just keeping it, see how long, you know, till I want to use it. But I've been buying things from vendors, which I don't think that's a bad idea. But it's been eating my money up. And so I have 245,000. Actually, might be slightly more than that. Uh, so we can go ahead and view sale history if you want. So you can see what my latest sales were. So the funny thing is I made quite a bit from the maple, this thing, the bronze. I, somebody sold that for like 30 or 40 uh, gil. I rebought it and resold it. Uh, look at that. Withered uh, hatchet. This. This. So you can see quite a bit of gold just from those. And then I went and got that silt stone because it looked like it was a good price. Threw it on there. I did actually sell some. Some lightning rocks, stuff like that. So just some random things here and there. But hey, you know, it's actually selling over time, which is awesome. So uh, let's go ahead and entrust or withdraw Gil. So here you go. So we can take all of it. There you go. Withdraw. I guess there's not like an all button. Oh. I guess when you go, there you go, negative, there you go. And if you want to see stuff on here, we have here. So some of this will probably have to come off soon or I might have to look at them or update the prices, but there you go. And I might end up in the future getting another one of the retainers. All you do is go to the retainer, do the same thing again. So there you go. Um, left in hand, there you go. So we're talking about that chest piece, right? Yeah, which was just a slight upgrade. I think that was it, right? I think we got it all. Oh, I opened it again accidentally. Yeah, because we got the belt. Yeah, yeah. So there you go. And then we can go ahead and upgrade the gear. So there you go. So over time, I can. I'll prob there's probably many wet methods of finding more gear if we craft it ourselves eventually. Or if we even use the... Um, I was going to say, even if we use the, uh, what do you call it? Oh, independent jeweler. Oh. We have never bothered to check this NPC out. That makes us kind of stupid, doesn't it? Uh, so, left and right ring. Let's do that. Uh, rings are just rings, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my goodness. So, I guess earrings first, then? Earrings. Okay, so they don't give you the crafting stuff, but they do give you... Because CP is crafting points, I believe. And then GP is your GP. Well, you see down there the GP. So that's a different one. So Apparently those are, th those are what affects that. Okay. And then the necklace item here. GP or CP. So there's GP again. There you go. And these are pretty cheap. And then GP, CP, so GP. The the CP stuff is for crafting points. Uh, that's like the same thing as the mana there kind of thing. But uh, their version of it. So there you go. Wristbands. Because um, I'm assuming I haven't looked at wristbands forever. I'm hoping. I guess they're over here somewhere. Oh my. Okay. And then, yeah, yeah that was that one. And then here you go. Rings, so you want uh, GP, and then I guess two of them. There you go. And that will upgrade. Oh, look at that. I'm interested in seeing that. Well, nothing's going to change that, right? Oh, except the chest we got. But yeah, it's all going to be about this here, so 400. There you go. So that goes to 507, which... Allows you to use, say, this ability right here, the King's Yield, increase the number of items attained, gathered by two. So, you know, the yield we just used, that alone could be worthwhile using. Sure, you know, you can't use some of your other things, but that would give you double. If, if you're high enough on the uh, other stuff, because you don't want to fall too behind. Okay, there was one other person I wanted to show you, and I don't know... Oh, here they are. Let me look up the names, because I wrote it down. This person sells something called Rabbit Pie. Here it is. So Rabbit Pie will give you gathering max 6 and perception plus 2. There's other foods out there probably even better than this down the road. But um, clearly for our stuff, I think this is worthwhile anyway. So I'll just do 20 for now. Um, so yeah, I'll grab 20 of those. And there's also this other one here called... Um, yeah. 
Flamenti, whatever. And this does 10 crafting points, which it's the same idea, right? That's for your this, the, the CP stuff, which is something you would want uh, for crafting. It's the, the GP versus CP, the CP is way more important. Because as far as I know, every time you craft a recipe, like from scratch, you start a whole new, basically, like, you're doing a whole run on that, basically, so... Oh, and by the way, we have 30 seconds to get back to that place. Well, we don't have to get there in 30 seconds, but... Okay, so we're gonna go... We have our recommended gear, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna update this. Nice, 41, so that's awesome. We're gonna go to our recommended gear now. We're gonna equip this. 39, awesome. And then what we're gonna do is travel here, teleport... And I guess this has its own little thing now. Awesome. And this should be up in like any second, basically. Like by the time I load and hit the button, it'll be already there pretty much. So let's put that on so we don't forget. Let's put that on. And there we have it. And it's, yeah, it's up. And it looks like it's over here. Okay, so. Same idea, my friends. Here you go. No one else is here, so this is probably not as important to people, but whatever. There you go. Is the music... Oh, I think it's the zone that changes the music. I keep thinking, oh, is it because of this? You know what I should be doing? And I, I shouldn't be screwing around because this is where I'll screw everything up and kill myself, but... I should be getting the lower level of this thing. So this is number three, right? I should be getting the number two version of this. Um, why am I being so stupid to do this right now? What did it look like? It looks like that. There it is. Oh, it's only 15. Oh, it jumps that much, huh? Yeah, let's do the three, I guess. I just didn't want to waste that much, honestly. And then we'll do this, because I think that's important. Okay. And then there we go. We'll just do it this way. I don't know what that stuff is, but I've been ignoring it. Huh. I've never seen Dark Matter Cluster, and it's like, do I waste it? Or oh, screw it, I'll get this. I don't care enough. <gasps> and I got the rare one anyways of that. That's cool. There you go. And that, my friends, is just how that works. You know, I've never done this till today, so... Um, apparently I've learned some stuff. And it's showing up, so I think they've also changed some of the ways of how it works. Probably because people were using the slot thing in the first pay at place. Uh, but uh, I guess they make it all show up now. I think it sounded like at one point it had a different UI and it kind of hit everything, so. Okay. So we're going to go to here and then we're going to go to the botanist guild. This is probably my longest episode I've ever done for a Let's Play series. Could have definitely broken this up, but whatever. Uh, I'm not supposed to go here, apparently. Oh, I'm a noob. We're probably supposed to go down there and then go back to the... <laughs> now you see why you need your gold. People like me just spending it going all over the place. Okay, so let's do this, and let's put our sneak on. Yeah, keep try to keep remembering to keep sneak on always, just because, um, yeah, it's worthwhile. So that was embarrassing, though. So that other node, which I've never seen before, came up randomly. That other node, though, that I think is probably the most brilliant, horrifying, stupid thing ever. I could have mined it. I had no problem with that, but I... 
because I looked at some old guides and stuff like that. Basically, I just assumed it was hidden, so I couldn't, I couldn't do anything with it. And here I could have the entire time. So, yeah, you live and learn, right? Okay. So he was up here somewhere. <laughs> right where that other node was. <laughs> okay. There you go. There you go. Yeah, we're not giving those ones over. So we're supposed to find the Trouble Carpenter. That's cool. So we're doing a bit more. So the downside with the chokeable music is it's cutting off the cool music. And there's a way to turn that off. I don't know if it's actually through the this thing or if it's through the options. It's probably through the options, honestly, but... Just be regular options then. Oh, put there, yeah. <laughs> ah. I guess that made her happy. Did that re inspire her to keep being the guild master? Sure, if you take me all the way back. So there's these like rare spruce trees and instead we're going to butcher the last few up. Oh, is that supposed to be a spruce sapling? like the cute ending is like Final Fantasy 14 uh, see I love the music here you gotta admit though that was that was adorable yeah <laughs> I'm 
Okay. I am very tired, but you know what? It was so well worth it. I enjoyed that a lot. I hope you guys enjoyed it as well. There we go. <laughs> so probably same idea on the helmet here that's a pretty nice upgrade okay so we'll do that too again and then we'll get our new I bet you this looks nice comparison I never did the other one yeah look at the jump there it's beautiful and there you have it my friends just like that this is concludes Botanist quest for the Final Fantasy XIV A Realm Reborn. I love that. So we did mining and botanist today. There you go. So both of them, I don't believe they they act as the your continued guild master. Um, yeah, because I think what happens is they refer you to the next person. So, which is uh, something, I don't know these people's names, they have crazy names, but that's the idea. You get referred to a whole new person and go from there. But, uh, there you go. That's it. We have finished mining and botanist, and look at that. We're, this is a pretty young, short Let's Play series so far, and already we got two uh, classes to 50 without, you know, doing something silly. I just went out, kept mining, and... Cutting down trees kind of thing, and I did that over and over, and look at us. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this. Please don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, all that fun stuff. And uh, we will see you wonderful people next time. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.